Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another Grand Theft Auto 5 GTA 5 Online Ill-Gotten Gains DLC video. We are breaking down the DLC content video by video. If you haven't seen any of the videos I've done so far, go to my channel page or click the annotation at the top of the screen. It should be the top right-hand corner. Uh, basically, that will take you to the videos and you can pick and choose what content interests you the most. Um, I'm not that excited to make this video, but for the sake of covering everything in the DLC, we will be doing it today. So, uh, yeah, let's take a look. By the way, you'll notice I'm in my other garage with all my big juicy cars. Uh, we actually run out of space in the other garage, so we're going to start filling this one up now, which is kind of cool. Right, so let's take a look, and I'll show you why I'm not that interested in this particular video. we got this thing. The <laughs> Vapicino. I... This car does not look interesting to me. I, it might have something cool about it when I get it, or it might excite me like the Brawler. Like, I didn't think I'd be excited about the Brawler. Um, but this car just doesn't doesn't tickle my pickle, as they say. So I am... Yeah, whatever. We'll see what it's all about. I'm going to have it delivered here. And uh, we shall see if it can surprise me. In the comment section below, uh, I'd love to hear what you guys think of this car, whether it is something that makes you excited like it does, like I am for classic cars and that sort of a thing. Uh, is this your type of car? If it is, I kind of apologize, because I'm just like not interested. I'm not going to be that excited about it. I don't think. So yeah, it'll be interesting to see. I kind of hope it does surprise me, but I can't imagine it will, to be honest. So yeah, while we're waiting for it, I'll uh, I'll pause the video and I'll see you in a sec. There. Um. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it looks very as expected. Nothing. Nothing stands out as of yet. But I'm gonna be honest with you guys. Uh, apparently there's some like decal stuff will be added to apply at Los Santos Customs, so that might be cool, but at this stage, I mean, this, this, is, this is a 200 grand car that looks like any other car you'd find in Los Santos. I mean, maybe it's a little bit special in the fact that it's like one of those old... Uh, I don't know what the name of the theme is, but like, you see them in like American films and like 19... I want to say 70s? Maybe earlier, 1930s? <laughs> Who knows? But like the old American style, kind of wide, low rider cars. But it's just not something that I'm that much of a fan of. So let's just repair it here. And take a look at some of the things you can do. So bumpers. Fairly standard. A chin spoiler. Wow, look at that. Actually, that is pretty cool. That's kind of weird. I've never seen that before. Like a hot rod. That's the word. Yeah, let's. I'm gonna go all out on this. So this is the thing that they were talking about in there. Because if that if that's what it is, I'm I'm really disappointed. I thought they were like stickers for the back. Man, why on earth would you get that? If it, it, I I don't get it. I thought they were stickers. I genuinely thought from the screenshots we saw they were stickers. So we'll get the dual exhaust. I'm going to try my best to make this car look cool. I just don't think it's possible. Uh, okay, alright. Okay. Yeah, you, yeah, I don't... Mm, you're saving yourself a little bit here. My car, poor little car. Should we get some neons? Uh, front, back, and side. <laughs> Let's get like a mint green. Yeah. Okay, why not? Well, I honestly don't. I mean, I really want you guys to like leave comments and be like, Ollie, you're missing, you're completely missing the point of this car. But I'm just not seeing it. I'm just not seeing it. I'm going to do it in like... <laughs> it looks like Marge Simpson's car. You know, from The Simpsons. That's what it just looks like a, an old estate car. That's what it looks like. Screw it. I'm going to have it in pink. That was an expensive, ugly paint job, but whatever. How does it look like? In, it might look good in purple. 
I <laughs> I just don't get it. But that's the beautiful thing about YouTube. We're all very, very different people. And, um... Yeah, I mean, I'm never ever going to be like every single one of you. So I'm sure there are people out there that are like, Dude, you just don't get it. And I hope that is the case. But this, <laughs> this is such an ugly car. Why on earth is this in a DLC? This just looks like it. It honestly just looks like a car you would... You would find laying about. Oh, thank you. You might actually make the car look slightly better. I... I, I'm sorry guys, <laughs> I've, ooh, that's like a dude, he, see he's got a cool car, I just don't, I just don't get it, I really don't get it, but the car, <laughs> it just makes me laugh, just, uh, I love how I left the mint neons with the bright pink paint job, that's, that's something quite special, um, but yeah, I mean, I've spent the last pretty much seven or eight minutes just saying, how boring and awful this car is. Um, this is probably the weakest part of the content DLC. Um, I'm happy to get this out of the way. I mean, I'm, okay, I'm going to try and look at the positives here because that's the kind of person I am. I do like the lights at the back. That is kind of cool. Um, you know, I think this car is actually cooler than they gave it credit. I don't see the wheelie thing. You're never going to make this thing do a wheelie. I mean, maybe you are. Did I see everything in Los Santos Customs? I have a feeling I might have missed something. So I'm going to go back. One thing I am really disappointed about. I thought there were genuinely stickers that we're going to be able to place on the car. Because that's what the screenshot kind of alluded to. But just the weird thing on the back. And I don't even get to light them up. Like, no. Yeah, I'm disappointed in, I'm disappointed in that. Where is Los Santos Customs now? Get all, I'm all lost now. A friend, uh, Team 43 member joined. Sweet. It's probably going to come chase me down and shoot me. That's what most of you tend to do. You guys are such trolls. But I love you. I love you as well. Um, okay. I'm going to take one last look in here. And, uh... <laughs> I'm sorry, I, was, I crushed them because I was looking at this awful paint job. I kind of forgotten how bad it is. I should really take the Team 43 logo off. This is not representing the crew very well. But, um, yeah, okay, let's have a quick, let's have a quick last look. But I'm pretty sure this is... Uh, hood horn, respray, roof. We did do roof, didn't we? Ah. Ah, okay custom roof so you can take the roof off it's kind of cool uh, what else can you do I'm glad that I came back okay before I leave because I know people will say it I went back to Los Santos customs again and I actually bought a turbo and maxed out the engine I did everything performance wise to see maybe this thing on the back might come in useful it will like do a wheelie there'll be super crazy acceleration I'm at the airport let's see what happens is this car a complete utter troll I <laughs> I know it's gonna upset some people but I'm interested to see whether it will go at full speed here we go we're in the airport let's go super speed here we go let's see okay quickly off the line you can hear the turbo kicking in Nice screenshot there. I should probably do that. But, uh... Gonna be honest... Not, not feeling it. It just doesn't go very fast. <laughs> I just... It's just... I don't know what else I can say. Even with maximum, maximum performance enhancement, it's n still not going that fast. Doesn't look particularly cool. I mean, I know I've given it a pink paint job, but uh, yeah, there you go, guys. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed.